Everything was perfect. And suddenly I became sick. I decided to become empowered. I decided to take control. And I asked questions. And I had some wonderful nurses and wonderful dialysis technicians and doctors who were very supportive. They answered my questions and I became a self-patient. I learned everything that I could and a disease that seemed uncontrollable was now in my grasp. I went back and played college soccer and I married that girl in my dreams. And life was good on dialysis. You have to respect the disease to be able to take charge of it. Then one day a nurse came to me and asked me if I was interested in home dialysis. I said yes. And, and I quickly became empowered. I was in charge of my treatments. And I took a machine home with all the support of my wife, my friends, my family. And they helped me take care of myself at home. And that's very important, the support team, the support system, and the family they make all the difference. That was February of 2000. So back then, the machine had to be built to the house. The electricity had to be rebuilt. The plumbing had to be re-ran through the house. And so I, my problem was my home was my dialysis clinic. Therefore, I couldn't leave my home very often. However, I didn't have to go to a clinic 45 minutes away. So that was worth it. And I was able to dialyze at home and in bad weather, in my pajamas or whatever I, whatever I wanted to do. And that was great. <laughs> 